Thousands of local children are heading back to school over the next couple of weeks, but you may be surprised how many will show up without the needed school supplies. Money editor John Delano takes a closer look. Children are getting back to school, but many will arrive in class without the basic school supplies. Jennifer Plum teaches middle school math. How bad is the situation out there? It's different for every kid. Um, an example, one student texted me. I give my cell phone num number out to students and, how was your summer? Great. Are you ready for back to school? No, we don't have money for summer. One out of three local students does not have the basic supplies for school, says Justin Brown of the Education Partnership. We serve six counties, Allegheny being in the center. Right. So when we look at that mix between rural and urban, uh, it's, it's about one out of three. So you can translate that to about 60,000 students. And unfortunately, John, that's conservative. The Education Partnership is one local nonprofit trying to meet a tremendous need. We started with the program of the teachers coming to us. That's our core program. And it's amazing how many teachers like Jenny get in their car on their own time, come across town from as far as Aliquippa and the six counties right. to access resources at no cost at our center. We are on on target to distribute five million dollars worth of school supplies wow. at no no cost. Appearing on a taping of the Sunday Business page, Laura Carlson described the Adopt a School program, where local companies pay for bags of supplies to help students. This is a bag that we actually use in our Adopt a School program, where we partner with companies and businesses who are interested in supporting a specific school. So a company can actually adopt a school in their neighborhood or someplace else. And, that's right. And that's our yes. That's our main focus. About 25 bucks supplies a child for the school year, and teachers open their supplies to all. Everyone's welcome. You need a pencil. That's not going to be a barrier for me. John Delano, KDKA TV News. And you can see John's full story and interviews on school supplies on the Sunday business page this Sunday at 6.30 a.m.